Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jaco. Today we're going to be playing some Baldur's Gate 3, which at first looked like a game I would totally be uninterested in. I thought, what the hell is Balding Gate and why is it so good? Everyone on the internet is going crazy for it right now, so I folded and decided to give it a try. I'm making this intro after I played the game and I actually had a blast. If you've been around the channel long enough, you'd know that obviously I had to go with an evil character and made bad evil choices. I only played for around an hour and a half and I'm really, really curious what other choices choices I'll be able to make throughout the rest of the game. But without further ado, let me just show you how it went. Never mind, I have to create an account. <laughs> I can choose a dwarf to be my guardian, that's hilarious. Oh, I have a tail? Nice. I've always wanted a tail. Instead of the dark urge, I want to be the dark splurge. <laughs> Alright, this will be our guardian, this uh, halfling woman. Small yet capable. <laughs> I guess we'll see about that. I don't know who this squid guy is, but he's kidnapping people against their will, and I don't appreciate that. Oh crap, have I been kidnapped too? Oh yeah, that's me, the dark splurge. They also put some worm in my head against my will, so hopefully that doesn't come back to, you know, bite me in the ass or anything. Now there's some random voice in my head named Narrator. Get the hell out of here. Curse whoever did this. Behind this cruel prank will meet your Oh yeah, I bet it is just a cruel prank. Nothing to worry about. I'm gonna investigate the pool of worms. Success! I can now look into the pool of worms. Cool. Oh no! A brain jar? <laughs> I wanna get a brain jar. Attack, yeah. Stupid brain. I probably just murdered someone. The hell is a neural apparatus? Can I attack that too? Oh, it's an elevator. Ah. This brain is talking to me and it sounds like a little girl, which sounds innocent and all, but I want to kill it. I think you're past the point of saving. Tell me what to do. Uh, just break the skull. Just yank it right out. The guy's probably toast anyways. He doesn't need his brain. Oh my god! You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. That's actually a great idea. Let's do that. With the desire to rip its tender, moist meat. Who is this narrator and how do they know me so well? What the hell is it? It's like a dog now. That's a funny looking dog. Oh, it's running away. It's called a newborn. Come back here. The dark splurge started a conversation. I'm gonna love to see that every time. There's a green woman behind you, dark splurge. Look out. Never mind, now she's in front of you. Oh, so this woman and I have the same brain tumor thing. Worm. Goddamn government putting worms in our heads. I just realized I woke up with my weapon. Why did that happen? Just out of curiosity. Or shove? Yeah, let's shove him. Shove that way. Yeah. Stupid. Do a maimed hand attack on that imp. Yeah. Oh, I have some frost breath. Yeah. Stupid imps. Oh, that was sick. Toggle non-lethal attacks? Hell no, that's stupid. I want to murder them. Yep, head through that uh, butthole looking thing. There we go. I'm gonna start pushing random buttons, see what happens. What? Oh, did I just kill them all? Oh, I think I did. Oh well. Oh yeah, someone needs help in this, this pod. Yeah, sorry, there's no time. I need to get out of here. Oh, there's the brain thing. All right, let's give it a little whack with my hammer or my staff or whatever the hell this is. What the hell is a dip? I don't want to do any dip. I don't know what this means. Ow, I've been stabbed. I'm very low on health, little brain. Yeah, die, doggy. I can do some healing. There we go. Oh, I accidentally healed with the wrong person. Huh? Well, that's not a good idea because I'm dead. The dark splurge is an absolute sandwich. Wake up, little buddy. <laughs> splurge. Wake up, man. Oh, I'm watching the transformation happen. Goddamn government folk. Doing this to good, hard-working Americans. Yeah, I'm already pretty much doomed. I died to, like, a little dog brain thing. Gonna attack some more brain jars. Take that brain jar. Oh, I just died. There was a bunch of acid in the brain jars, and I'm dead. I died again because there's a bunch of acid on my body. I keep going down. <laughs> what a joke. All right, can I just leave dark splurge behind as the woman? Oh, here's the dark splurge. Get out of the acid. Get out of the acid. Okay, you're alive. I didn't know that these restoration things actually healed me. I don't know why they're helping me, even though I'm like vandalizing the place and killing everything. It's just not giving me the tutorial on how to help down characters, even though I've gone down two or three times already. The Pirates of the Caribbean guy, Davy Jones. Oh, this is a big battle going on, but they're fighting. I could just let them fight. Swipe at a creature to not get prone. I want to do that to this little dog. I missed. Okay. I don't know how the hell I missed. Ow. 
Little shit just quick scope me from across the room. Another step forward. Just keep running, splurge. Keep going, bro. Oh, I have to just keep uh, ending my turn. Oh, I see what's going on now. Okay. The uh, Davy Jones is dead. He's not doing no. No, no. Do any. Oh, I can do a frost breath real quick. Hell yeah. That'll do extraordinary amount of damage. Oh, I even hurt my teammate a bit, but that's fine. Yes, keep shooting the woman. Not me. Oh, she's dead. No. Yes, yes. Get her. Get her. Not me, please. Yes. Get the hell out of here, Splurge. We're out of here. You made it in time. No, he should be like a foot behind me, but I have plot armor. I am the dark splurge. How do I know how to use any of this technology? I feel like I'd be a boomer when it came to alien technology and like tentacles and shit. Okay, yep, I, I, oh, I, I like hyper drove away. Ow, I'm just floating through the ship. I don't know how to drive this thing. Are you kidding me? I just woke up. Oh, hey there, uh, tentacle man. Oh, <laughs> a rock knocked me out of the ship. Are you kidding me? <laughs> But I have the power of the force. I'm a Jedi. All right, I gained five experience for jumping out of a squid ship. Be yourself. Think dirty thoughts. What? My personal quest as the urge. There's a fisherman I think I landed on and murdered. Yeah, I'll just take his money and go. You drink in the pungent corpse. Since you awoke on the ship, your mind has been cold and empty. But My character here is a total psychopath, which I'm all for. Try to remember the last time you stood above a corpse. Yeah. This corpse that I'm standing over of the fisherman is like apparently turning me on or something. I don't know what the hell is going on. But yes, now I've successfully As been turned you on. Delve into your mind as it's filled with flashes of a thousand different dead. Yes, all the people I've killed. I'm starting to remember. Look at the flame in my eyes. That actually looks so badass. I'm not going to lie. A perfumed letter. Oh, he was trying to send it to a loved one, but instead he got hit by a car or something. I'm not sure. Oh, here's the inventory. Ah, uh, this is much better because I, I got like new armored stuff I didn't know how to put on. I just took off all my clothes. I turned off nudity, so I wonder if I'd have like a big old red monster. Uh, you know, never mind. All right. Magic missile. Yeah, okay, that is actually a really good move. I like that a lot. I'm just gonna freeze him. Idiot brain thing. You made a grave mistake. What did I do? What? Was I not supposed to do that? Get out of the fire, splurge. <laughs> I died. <laughs> Well, I found a hat, a cool little stylish hat. Maybe dying was a good thing. Cowboy demon thing. Oh, there's a bunch of gold in this barrel. I actually am kind of glad I died. I did a really shitty job at looting before. The advantage I can get. Oh, I just dipped my crossbow in fire. That's sick. Hell yeah, I'm gonna light you on fire, little idiot. This game is just way, way more than I thought it was. I'm gonna go continue looting corpses, though, because that's just what I do. Who's this? Uh, a random traveler. I was not the one who killed all those people back there. Trust me. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Kill yourself, you look capable enough. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Uh-oh, no. I knew I should have killed him. <laughs> Quickly rolling away. We've been staring at each other for like 10 minutes, though. So. All right, time to die. I haven't done anything to you yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already threatening him. I'm in quite the state, but I think I'm the dark splurge. <laughs> Imagine that's what you think your name is after you woke up from some amnesia thing. He's got a bunch of grease bottles. He doesn't seem all that useful, but I'll keep him for now. Oh, and I can level up too. He probably should have given me a tutorial on how to level up. I was not paying attention to this at all. I found a violin. I'm not proficient with a music instrument though. God damn it. Maybe someone else will. I'll give it to them. I don't think that's how you open a door, dumbass. You're the one who left me to die on the ship. Oh, crap. Uh-oh. <laughs> this is awkward. Doing some Jedi mind trick, though, real quick. Left you to die? I don't have a clue what you mean. I'll just gaslight her. They're going to consume us from the inside and turn us into mind flayers. Calm down. We escaped. We survived. There's no need for dramatics. I'm the dark splurge. Let's make haste. Nobody's questioned my name so far. Maybe because it's so cool. A bunch of cool abilities, man. This game is just must have endless replayability. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing, and I'm learning so much. Oh, she's looking at that dead body here. Let me loot it for you. All right. What if I use some magic missiles? Open sesame. Nope. Didn't work. Just gonna keep shooting the door with this arrow. 
Yeah, nothing is making this door budge. All right, fine. I guess we'll figure out another way. That guy just collapsed. Oh, there's a mind flare right here. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion? Nope, compassion. never heard of it. So even though we're not one of the squid people, he still has some sort of power over us because of the worms in our head. Close those eyes forever. <laughs> Stomp right on his head. Just like a watermelon. My two friends here just stood by and did nothing uh yeah i'll take the skull sure i want to start collecting skulls it's gonna be my weird quirk oh a bunch of dead goblins let's loot these guys first yeah come back down sorry <laughs> i know i made you guys go up there but come back down please Ooh, some bones hell yeah let's take all the bones too i'll collect any and all bones and skulls there's a bunch of goblins here where did he come from he just teleported out of nowhere trying to creep around us and loot the crypt the only thing you own is your life leave before i take that too i'm the haunted one that's one of my passive features i'll have no problem getting this yeah intimidation check i'll probably leave him pissing his pants little nerd second worm gets the cheese and all um second mouse gets the cheese no nobody's getting any damn cheese right nice okay i think we found a way in all right can we hop down here how do i get <laughs> How do I get in there? Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> I just got to walk through the floor. Oh, who are all these freaks? Okay, okay. We got a fight on our hands. All right, that's about all I can do for now. Hide behind the bed. <laughs> We're just using as much cover as we can. Just hope they don't walk in here. How did you hit him? That's There's no way. You shot him through a wall, hacker. All right, I'm going to piercing strike you. And it missed. Great. All right, I'm going to use all my magic missiles on him because he's about to kill my friend. And he's still alive somehow. Hacker. My teammate's going to die. Oh, <gasps> they missed him. Oh, he's dead. I think he got choked out by the snake thing. And now I'm poisoned even more. Crap. <laughs> I'm going to die. Looks like I can. This might be our only hope. Yes. Okay, I lit some of them on fire. Is this supposed to happen? Because I feel like I'm useless right now. And now the room's on fire. How Shadowheart is still alive. I am so genuinely confused. They're still just using aimbot to shoot me through the wall. Maybe I should have used a different door or something. I, uh, I, yeah, game over. Okay. There we go. Now I burned them all alive. I did a much better job, I think, that time. This game is very unforgiving. It just, I'm, I'm doing my best. I'm learning. For once, I'm not trying to actually be an idiot, which is actually, I guess, makes sense. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, he just firebombed the whole room. That wasn't good. That was not very cool at all, bro. There we go. Now he's dead. And now it's just uh, two of them left. There we go. Now there's only one of them left. All right, this is going much smoother than last time. All right, time to get magic missiled. I'm just going to throw it right through this wall. There we go. Or around the corner. There we go. That went way better than last time. This game is very unforgiving. I'm doing a lot of learning. And I hope you guys are too. Maybe teach me some things about what I did wrong. Because I, I guarantee you guys know more, way more than I do. I think this is where we're going to leave it off with our heroes for now. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'd also quickly like to thank you guys for over 2,000 subscribers. That means the absolute world to me. If you are new, consider subscribing. And in the meantime, check out some more of my videos here. And I'll see you guys in the next one.